Happy Monday, Pokemon collectors and investors. Today we got some news for you guys, some new cards being revealed, and we're going to start off with these cards. These are from Paradise Dragona, the Japanese set. This will be included in our English set, Surging Sparks, as you guys can see right here. All of this is from Poke Beach. It's a great website for news, so check them out. Uh, but we'll take a look at the Bruxious first. Now, if I'm being honest, not a fan of the Pokemon, pretty mid, but... I do like the artwork of this card, um, the darkness of this. Uh, underwater cards are usually pretty good, so it's kind of a bummer. Um, wish this artwork was with a different Pokemon. So yeah, um, just a little bit disappointing for me. But um, if there's any Bruxious fans out there, you guys got your, your IR, so, you know, good for you. Um, this is the Braviary IR. I'm pretty pumped on this card. I love the look of this card. Not the biggest fan of this Pokemon per se, but um, still cool. Like so, this will be um, a card that I will have to be snagging up uh, from our uh, Surging Sparks set. So yeah, so these just got revealed. Pretty cool. Like like I said, Bravery is looking good. Bruxious, eh, in my opinion. Um, Bruxious fans, let me know in the comments. Um, here's their basic po uh, basic cards. We'll see that a little bit more in a second as well. But yeah, some good information from Poke Beach. Then we had this card. Um, Lysia's Appeal. This is from Paradise Dragona as well. Now, this card, I'm not, like, if you're new to the channel, I'm not really into the trainers. Definitely not into the waifus. I collect, you know, for the Pokemon. But, this is a nice looking card, and I like the Altaria in the background. So, this could be very interesting. Um, I wonder what this card will do in Japanese, because those waifu cards are kind of expensive. But, uh, I'll be interested to see what it does in English as well. Let me know what you guys think um, in the comments that this card will do. But they all, I like the Altaria. I like the pose. I, I like the card. It's a, it's a good looking card. So um, one of the you know one of the nicer trainer cards. You know, not gonna complain. Um, next up, we had some promos revealed. Um, we're gonna go jump back to Paradise Dragona in a second. But these were the promos revealed from that Terrapagos, um UPC. And sorry, it's like this is like the best photo we have right now. So you guys might have to use a little bit of your imagination. Um, I don't hate these promos. I like, but I think it's weird why, I don't know why they did two golds and then this version. So, yeah, um, I don't know how to feel about this. I I like Terrapagos and I'm excited for Stellar Crown, but this UPC seems very... Uh, yeah, I, I'm probably gonna pass on this one, uh, which is unfortunate. So these are the these are the same cards. Um, also, this is just obviously the non-gold version. Um, but like Lapras got screwed. How did Lapras not get an SIR? I don't know, or an IR. I mean, like a nice. I don't know. Lapras got a little screwed. Just my opinion. Um, now we're going to jump back to Paradise Dragona real quick. We're just going to go over this real quickly. So this is the... Um, we got a few more IRs that got revealed. And uh, we're going to go over the just the full um, normal set list here. We still don't have... We're still missing some cards, so we're still waiting. And this is only... Once again, this is only going to be half of our Surging Sparks. Um, so Titan... Don't really like the Pokemon too much. Love the card, though. Um, like the artwork, you got the Whalemar down here. Big fan of Pokemon in the background. Um, this is a cool card. This card is popping. Um, really like this card a lot, actually. Um, it's just very, it really stands out to me. So, uh, absolutely love that card. The Bra Vibrava um, Drayton. Take a look at him real quick. Zoom in on him. Eh, that's okay. He ain't doing much for me. Not the coolest trainer. Um, same thing, you know, eh, it's okay. It's a trainer. Now, the Skyscraper, building Pokemon. Not a fan of the Pokemon, um, but this card's kind of cool. I kind of like the vibe. I like the colors. So, he's not my favorite. I can't help it. But, yeah, it's not it's not bad. So, I would say this one stands out to me the most as being the best. And then this one's good, too, I would say. So, like, two good and three mid, and this one's okay. I don't know. So, yeah. Um... 
Next up, we're just going to, you know, Surging Sparks. We've seen this all before. Um, we're just going to scroll through these real quick. These are all the basic cards from the set. Paradise Dragona main set card. So, execute. And you know what's funny? As we scroll through these, we'll just take a quick look at them all. It's kind of unfortunate. I can't even see what's happening in this card. Oh, okay, that's pretty cool. Zoomed out, I could not tell what was going on. Now this, this is what I, it's funny. This is what I was just talking about. So see this artwork that's going on right here? Wouldn't this be so cool? Sometimes you see cool artworks on just the basic cards and you wish you got like a full art or IR, SIR version. That's probably one of them right there. Um, that's a cool looking card. Um, let's see what else. Got the Quaxley line, the Satoddle, um, Latios, Latios, okay, not bad. You know, it's an EX, just a standard EX. This one's cool, I like he's flying through a can uh, canyon doing like the trench run, Death Star trench run, that's pretty cool. Um, <laughs> yeah, I mean, just pretty normal basic cards. This artwork stands out to me a little bit. like this one a lot. Um, let's see what else we got. Goldango um, skateboarding. Is he skateboarding? I like that. That's cool. Um, I love Executor. like how he's popping out of the card. That's pretty cool. Um, I've got Altaria here. Yeah, not a, not a ton. It's looking like a pretty normal set. So yeah um that these are all the standard cards smaller set small set for japanese but half of our english set so this is only half i can't wait to see what the other half is going to be like then uh this is like some more interesting news it's not too big um but it might be interesting for some of you collectors out there so there's been a few of these uh pokemon go cards coming out in chinese if you aren't familiar they're getting they're kind of like catching up. It's been kind of interesting. They're getting sets like late because anyways, Pokemon's coming to China and they're getting their sets at different times. And they were saying um, these Pokemon Go cards are getting like different artworks that we've never gotten. So I think that's pretty interesting, honestly, if I'm not, if I'm being honest. So um, pretty cool right here. I like the Zapdos. Um, you can see here is our Pokemon Go Zapdos, which is still pretty cool. Once again, this would have been cooler as a full art. They can't all be full arts, though. I get it. Or IRs. Um, so, yeah. So, this is the third set to feature Pokemon Go cards. And it's just interesting how they've been doing that. Um, they got some cool pack artwork, too. So, yeah. They're getting... Uh, they're getting like sets like mismatched and stuff shoved in. So they're getting like Pokemon Go in here, but like Pokemon Go is supposedly banned in China. So that's why they like took out the logo and it's new. I don't know. Um, these are cool. Um, See, so yeah, down here it says uh, because Pokemon Go is banned, blah, blah, blah. Um, Radiant Blastoise? Like, this is pretty cool. Radiant Venusaur. So if you guys are looking for some. Uh, alternate type of cards to collect um maybe consider looking at some of these chinese exclusives uh, not not that they're going to be like particularly super valuable per se probably but um they are just cool artworks that we don't have so uh i think that that is awesome and that means it's worth collecting in my opinion i don't currently have um any of these chinese exclusive in there i think there's some others as well but they are cool, and I do like seeing different artworks. And there is um, some artworks from the uh, new Pokemon Pocket game that's supposed to be coming out. Those cards look good. So super excited for that to drop. Um, let me know if you guys are going to be playing the Pokemon Pocket when it comes out. I'm going to give it a go. So um, that is, I think, is going to do it for this one. It's kind of a shorter, just a little update on some new cards coming out. Um, but thank you so much for watching. If you guys are this far in the video and you're not already subscribed, obviously you enjoyed the content. Um, so do yourself a favor, hit the subscribe button so you can stay up to date on when I post my latest videos. Also, if you guys want to stay up to date on when these, uh, 151 booster bundles are restocking, cause there's 
popping in all the time amazon now walmart like uh join the discord there's a link in the description we're about to crack 400 members on the discord and there's a lot of good people in there and uh because everyone has been posting when they come back in stock so many people have been able to get boxes a lot of people are getting sealed booster bundle displays now from amazon so um a lot of good wins there and so yeah if, if you want to be a part of the community there's buy sell trade just general chat tons of stuff in there so if you guys are interested um join that but it is Monday. It is Monday the 9th. So uh, for me, I'm a little bit excited. Um, if you guys couldn't tell from the jerseys on the wall behind, I'm a wee bit of a Niners fan. Just a bit. Um, so it's football day for me. So I am going to go watch some football. If you're watching this after the game and the Jets kicked our ass, feel free to come at me. And if the Niners, I mean, hey, I, okay, I'm going to leave with this. This is where I'm going to leave with the Niners. Never talk about them on here. Um, I was so devastated after last season. Um, yeah, it cut me hard. Um, so the last time that the Niners won the Super Bowl, I was three, three years old. So I don't remember it. And I thought last year was destiny. After we beat the Lions, it seemed like destiny. I thought it was going to happen. And I said that if Shanahan can't win with that roster he'll never win a super bowl and i hope i'm wrong i hope i don't know i'm i'm scared it's hard it's just hard to watch anyways but i am still excited so uh, i'm gonna be watching the game so i gotta go watch the niners jets so um that's gonna do it for this one guys thank you so much for watching and enjoying my rant i'll catch you guys in the next one and remember it was never a phase